there have been some extraordinary moments that happened in MLBB and similar to it records have been made which are not talk about much in the MLBB community so we will talk about those in this video Hi guys, Kazuki here and in this video I will talk about 5 world records that were made by MLBB players that are almost impossible to break. As you guys know, this video has redeem codes and I want to congratulate the winners of our previous video. Thank you for participating. And similarly, this video will have hidden codes too. Find it from the video and redeem it at kazukiofficialstore.com and your diamonds will be delivered instantly. Before starting this video, I want to mention that world records are still being broken every moment with every second being played. So if you know someone with a better score who broke the following records, just mention them in the comment section. So the first record that I want to talk about is of the highest skills. So there's a YouTuber called Dracula and according to the video uploaded by him, he played Alucard and managed to get multiple maniacs upon maniacs and secured 82 kills in the video. Which is the maximum number of kills that anyone has managed to secure in a live MLBB match. Many of you guys might think that this is a classic match and even I thought so. But at the end of video, you will be able to see that he secured all of these in Mythic 2 rank. Now I don't know what you guys might think about this, but according to me, this is some uploadable talent. I mean just look at the commitment and skills he put in to bring all these skills and still hold the game. Next, we will be moving the most death in MLBB history. When we talk about death, we all have diggy in our minds. Easy death and easy revive. And many might even recall that there was even a diggy feeding strategy recently. So there is a game uploaded by Gamesum who managed to hold the record of 56 deaths in a single game. Though his personal objective ruined the gameplay of his fellow teammates, but he did manage to make a record by doing so. I will however upload his passions and the risk he took to get this achievement. Please don't try to break this record as you will not only anger your team, but Moontoon also takes some serious action regarding multiple feeding players. Next comes the longest queue in MLBB. Well, in our usual matches, you only have to wait for 10 to 30 seconds to get matched with our opponent. Even in Mythical Glory, you will mostly take 1 to 5 minutes of time to get your suitable enemies. But this was not the case for MOBA Zen. Yes, this is same MOBA Zen who plays for the BTK or you can say Team Vele. While live streaming, he had to take a long queue. According to me, it was due to him being on a higher rank. The matchmaking algorithm wanted to find out the suitable players against him, but it crashed or something of that sort might have happened. The wait was so long that it took around 2 hours and 5 minutes to gate his opponents. Pretty wild, right? What would you do if this happens to you? Would you wait like he did? If you are looking for 100% safe and secure diamonds, Kazuki Official Store is here to fulfill your need. We are trusted by more than 100k MLBB players from India, Philippines and Europe to visit our website and browse between various packs. After that, I want to talk about the longest game in MLBB. Many of you guys might recall this as the longest game. Blue Panda played Jask in this game. I think he knew that there was a bug related to Jask, so he went to try out that bug and recorded at the same time. 
Their team was losing but in the late game he managed to trigger a bug where you could get unlimited Jask ultimate spawn. And he kept going on even after his team lost hope and went to AFK. At last the opponent decided to surrender and the game lasted for 1 hour and 5 minutes. And he did manage to win it. What a legend. But this record was broken by Central Assassin. You can check his YouTube channel to find out the longest game in MLBB. His game lasted for total of 2.4 hours which is a 145 minutes long. He was playing well in this game and managed to get the win too. Damn, if I lost a game that I played for more than 2 hours, I would end up breaking my phone. Next will be the maximum number of savage in a single time. As I was searching for maximum number of savage in a single game, I found out Mobazen's video on the maximum number of savages in a single game. You might get 1 or 2 savages in a single game, but 8 savages are insane. This needs skills, timing and most importantly, you have to be lucky. It's only my view, if you think differently, then feel free to share about your experience. Coming back to the video, I went for more research and found out the highest number of savages in one game has been secured 4 years ago. You will find the video on Mobile Legends TV. The guy playing is using Mia in this video. You will see that some of the skills of Mia don't even match with current Mia. But this was how powerful farm Mia was. It's really amazing to see how they could secure these savages so nicely. And for now, the maximum savages record has been set to a 10 savage in a single match. Now comes the shortest game in MLBB history. This is again achieved by Team Vietnam in the IESF match. The match lasted for 6 minutes and 11 seconds. Can you believe it? And as I said earlier, if you have any information which overcomes this record, feel free to comment about it down below. After that, I want to talk about the highest earning player in MLBB. The player's name is Benny Cutie and he earns a total of $60,000 per year. Isn't it insane? He earns even higher than Carl Z, who earns $50,000 in a year. Next is the channel with the highest number of subs. You already know the answer, it's none other than our idol, Jess No Limit. His channel currently has 26.3 million subscribers. Also, his main channel is the third most subscribed channel in Indonesia. Moving on, we have the most popular player. Once again, we have Jess No Limit as the most popular MLBB player having a total of 149 million followers in game. Finally, we have the highest peak viewers of the MLBB live stream. The M4 World Championship surpassed the M3 World Championship. Previous record of 3.1 million peak viewers to become MLBB most popular esports event. With a total of 4.2 million peak viewers watched Blacklist International vs RRQ Hoshi semi-finals. And before ending this video, here's a shout out from our previous video. Mick to Gamecake, Mr. Moreno, Kyle Quintella, the Scorpion Dorji, and Junior Kid. Do tell me if you have your amazing record that overtook these world's record of MLBB. And that was all for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Keep supporting Kazuki Official.